something on the runway. Um, Sorry. You're completely distracted. <laughs> Did you see the back? Yeah. You guys? Ready? My grandmother, she had a triple heart bypass 20 years ago, so it's heart disease is something that's close to me. Black women, I think that's our number one leading killer. So it's important when you're a celebrity to be able to lend your name and lend a smile and a pretty picture to something that's, you know, might save somebody's life. <laughs> but they asked me to be involved and I said, hell yes, of course. I know they do some great work and I've been following it over the years, so I'm quite honored to be involved. I'm wearing Badgley Mishka. They tightened everything and zipped up everything and put me in it, and I feel very gorgeous. So, thank you. Thank you so much. Pamela Rowland makes women look amazing. That's just it. That can be your new <laughs> byline. <laughs> so great. We were assigned. Yeah, this is the best blind, blind date I have ever had. Well, and she walked <laughs> right into the dress, so it worked perfect. I've worked um, on this project uh, for a couple of years, not, not the fashion show, but one year I designed a dress about four years ago for um, heart health for women and the red dress campaign. Uh, and I was, uh, one year I was a spokesperson. My third year that I'm the ambassador for Diet Coke and um, also for the Heart Truth campaign um, because I think it's very important that women take more care of their heart and to go to the doctor and get checked for heart disease and eat better, have a healthier lifestyle, work out and so I really hope that maybe we can get the numbers down. We can you know make more women aware of this and hopefully we get the numbers down. part of this. It was, it's an honor to be here tonight. It's my first one. I've watched them before. We've had guests on The View, Kristen Chenoweth, Heidi Klum, when they've walked before. So this is my first time walking. Uh, but to be able to spread awareness for women's health is certainly number one priority. I'm wearing Donna Karen in this fiery red gown. She's, she's outstanding. This woman knows how to design for women. I love you, Donna. You have been the silent mentor for me and my own designs. And um, the cause for heart health is number one. I try to work out, I call it a work in, work it in whenever I can, if it's a run home, if it's push ups with the kids, um, if it's racing my daughter in her backyard, and that's what we do, uh, and try to make my own doctor's appointments a priority. <laughs> Well, as they've discovered here tonight, if you dress, if you wear a red dress, it keeps your cholesterol down. But wait till you see my wife in this red dress. It'll raise your blood pressure. They contacted me quite a while ago, and as I started to investigate heart disease, I learned what many women don't know is that it's the number one killer of women in America and so I thought it was good to raise awareness. Uh, 
I'm wearing Isabella Oliver. It's in a paternity dress and I love it. It's comfortable, it's sexy, I'm so thrilled. Happy to be here, happy to be a part of it. Happy that we all made it safely out of Los Angeles into the New York blizzard. And we're all here safely, because it was a little chaotic yesterday. And uh, uh, this is Rebecca Taylor and uh, Brian Atwood shoes. And I came in, put the dress on, it fit perfectly, and we were done. So it was definitely the dress for me.